UW fans thrilled as the Badgers chopped down the Gophers again for the sixth straight year. Our team coverage continues with News 3's Mark Lovacott. He's got fan reaction on today's back and forth exciting game. Mark? And Andy, as you can imagine, fans very excited about today's big win. What a nail-biter towards the end, though. Fans certainly were feeling that. Wisconsin takes home the axe once again. Badger fans here were very excited to witness it. Neither the rain nor the cold weather. It's a big weekend. Could keep Badger fans from getting an early start for Badger football. Well, I think everyone's looking for an excuse to, to get out and drink at 9 a.m., period. But uh, it's, it's, it's fun. It's fun to watch Badger football and support your team. More than 2,000 people gathered for pregame fun, all with one thing on their minds. You know, it's history right here. It's for the axe. I'm very excited. I wish I had tickets, though. You don't, you don't have tickets, and you're here? No. Of course, cheering on the Badgers. So, Wait, hold on. but a Minnesota shirt. What is this? Tell I had to represent both a little bit. Commander Shine, we follow the Badgers. We were all in Vegas, 110 degrees. Now we're out here when it's 40 degrees and raining. Let's go Bucky. Some pretty tense moments, though, as the Badgers did end up winning this one. But, boy, you could feel the tension in the air here at this brand-new stadium here in Minneapolis. A lot of fans still celebrating here in the Twin Cities, Andy, and you can bet if they're Badger fans, they will be celebrating all night tonight as well. All right, Mark, Mark Lovacott live in Minneapolis. Mark, thank you very much. Mm -hmm.